Hi, I'm Bjorn Stenger from the Cambridge Research Lab of Toshiba and we have an interface here for a gesture input for a television. The idea is that, you know, sometimes the remote control is on the couch, you know, somewhere else and you just want to change channel or, you know, um, volume up or down and things like that. So you can just use your hand like a natural form of communication to interact. So I can show you how it works on this demo here. Basically, I just have to hold up my fist. I can choose the language here and um, select one of the videos here. There's a play button. I just hover over the play button. Then the video starts and, for example, I get a phone call. I just have to hold up my hand like this and it stops. So that, that's the basic idea. We also have some uh, 3D models here, um, which, you know, you can, for example, imagine also an application where you have information terminals in a shop and you cannot use a touch screen or you have glass front in front so then you could look at products or you know explore some information and so just select some options so you could imagine this kind of interface for any kind of electronic products like a TV or like an information terminal um, you know something you cannot control with a remote control um, something when you don't have to touch anything so it could be used for gaming it could be used for TV it could be used for video recorders all kinds of things So a similar gesture interface where you can steer with your fist and click with a thumb came on the market in the, the Cosmio laptops, um, I think just this year. And uh, what you've seen here on the big screen, it's the first time we exhibit this in public. Um, there's no plan at the moment to make this into a product, but Toshiba will make a cell TV, which has a cell chip inside, which has a lot of processing power. And these kind of applications would then be possible.